Glenn, you've just rung the bell for the uh, start of Sunday Ashes at Lords. How did it feel? Yeah, it was a nice little honour. A um, little, little nervous. I think I was more nervous ringing the bell than, uh, than I was playing out in the middle. You know, when you've got every eye on you, out, you know, just watching you ring the bell. It's okay when you're running in there to bowl. But uh, no, it was a, it was a nice honour. I enjoyed and, it. And particularly special for an Ashes test. Oh, very much so. You know, this is every young Australian cricketer growing up wants to play cricket for their nation, and they want to play here at Lords against England. That's uh, you know, that's a dream of every young Australian cricketer, as I'm sure it is every young English cricketer. Play Australia at Lords is is very special. And you're now up in in the media centre. What's it like? Sort of the other side of the glass. Yeah, no, I'm enjoying it. Uh, it's a great view from up there. Uh, and having a bit of fun, you know, just talking about the game and other little bits and pieces, trying to make it interesting. And it reminds me a little bit of sitting in the change rooms, uh, in the dressing room, watching the watching the cricket, you know, sitting with, with the other bowlers and, you know, the batsmen are doing the job and you're just chatting away, you chat about this and about that, a little bit about what's happening out in the middle too. So, no, it's been good fun. Um, so, you're on the honours board here uh, three times. Yeah. <laughs> and... Um, uh, I wanted to ask first about your 8 for 38. Um, what do you remember about that test match and, and that particular bowling display? Yeah, and I remember we came from Ed Edgebaston where we were well and truly beaten. We bowled the wrong uh, length, we bowled a little bit too short. So we did a lot of work on our, our bowling off the full run between the two games just to get a, f a fuller length and, and came out here. Um, I think that the thing I noticed most about Lords or I remember most about Lords is firstly getting here. We did play a one day match here beforehand which was great but to come here and just sort of soak everything up you know look around the field look around the stands uh, the dressing rooms that you know there's so much history and tradition and everything that goes with Lords and going to the rooms and looking at the five wickets in an innings ten wickets in a match and the, the hundred runs in an innings is, is very special and you look at the names on the on the board there and there's some legends of the game and you know it's a, a, a pretty amazing place and to think you know, we, I thought I want my name up there. You know, how good would it be? Um, and then we chose our our seats. I was sitting next to uh, Steve Waugh, and you know, from then on for the next three tests, or every time I came at Lords here to Lords, was uh, I, I sat in that same seat. So it is an incredible place. And I remember yeah, that first ball where there's more a hush around the ground than you know big noise. But it's an amazing place, and I've got great memories here.